Hi and Assalamu alaikum. Welcome once again to channel Technology Information. Okay. If you are first time on my channel, please make sure to subscribe and hit the bell notification for more latest update videos. Thank you. Let's get started. Today we are talking on Caterpillar C15, C16 and C18 models. The starting circuit and the fuel circuit and the fuel diagram. Okay. If you are having trouble problem in starting on this engine or fuel system problem, you can watch this video and for proper and great understanding to resolve the, all the problems related to the starting or the fuel problem. Okay. Look that. I already drawn the diagram for understanding because the diagram drawing is most in the time. Okay. This is our the engine control unit. This is our injectors. And this is our fuel tank. This is our fuel pump, uh, fuel filter, and so on. This is crankshaft position sensor and camshaft position sensor. First of all, we want to read the from scratch. Okay, look at that and listen. This is the our diesel tank. This is the our diesel outline. Okay. After that, this is the fuel primary fuel filter. After that, the fuel is going to the fuel transfer pump. This is the gear driven transfer pump to high pressurize the fuel. After that, this goes to the fuel filter. Secondary fuel filter. This secondary fuel filter have the fuel framing pump or manually by hand framing the fuel system. Okay. After that, the fuel is sent to the all injector. This injectors have one gallery in the head, top head. So, okay. Here, when here is a pressure buildup of the high pressure fuel. After that, when we crank the engine, the ECM or ECU VCA turning on, the relay sent supply to the ECM to turn on the ECM. Okay. After that, we have two sensor, cam shop and crank shop position. When our engine is to rotate, these sensors taking a signal, signals and send back to the ECM. ECM understand our engine is turning. This time each injector on top on firing. The ECM again the send the signal to the each injector which injector on the top and ready to fire. And so on the engine starting firing, engine rotating, the injector uh, we'll spray the fuels to the combustion chamber the engine will come to coming on starting position after that when the engine once again start engine is goes up and reach to the rated rpm this is the complete system of fuel system and starting system caterpillar c15 c16 and c18 models if you have problems in the starting system First of all, you verify the fuel system. If you are getting bubbles or this filter is be uh, lower, lower in a diesel, and this filter be low, little low fuel in a diesel, you check the fuel tank. Okay. After that, the fuel, your fuel tank is top up. You check this fuel filter, the fuel filter blockage, and you remove it and check an inspection and the upper seal of your fuel filter. If the fuel filter not is properly tied, it's getting here in the system, the engine will not start. This is the main problem of the diesel engine, any diesel engine. After that, the fuel is going to the transfer pump. This transfer pump, when, when your transfer pump is faulty or some dirt and dirt base inside this, this not going, 
does not pressurize the fuel to the secondary fuel system. Filter. You can open this this side of this fuel pump, this side, and crank the engine. Check the pressure. The fuel is coming out from here. Okay. After they retight and check this line and check this fuel filter and priming by hand. Check the top of and crank this nut and crank the engine and manually by hand. You priming the engine, and you see, when you see the high pressure, when you see the pressure, pressurized fuel and good amount of fuel here, then retight this nut. After that, if you have not problem of related to the fuel system, you check the SEM cam shaft position system, crank shaft position system. Right? This is the complete system and complete diagram of fuel system and the wiring system for the starting purpose. When we the crank the engine, crank the engine, the key switch or the module or the panel send command to the ACM. When the ACM wake up, after that the engine already is rotating, the engine, the ECU is taking the signal from the camshaft position sensor and crank shaft position sensor. The, the ECU is understand this is time for the starting and is the ECU ECM notice which which piston on the top dead center which which nozzle need to be fired on this time the ECU is maintain the all the fuel system and top dead center and all every each injector on the top and which fire after that the ECU signal to the ground the one side of injector and injector and check the fuel and the combustion chamber. This is the complete system of Caterpillar C15, C16, C18. I hope you understand in the better way. If you not understand or any problem on every engine, please write comment below for and wait for the next video. Thanks for watching and goodbye.